Good morning and welcome to morning coffee in Kyoto. Um, today with my Main Street Espresso. I still don't know what it means mug. Um, Valentine's Day in Japan, I'm sure you know and you have Googled, is different from Valentine's Day in other countries simply because the people who market it here wanted to have two days. So Valentine's Day is the traditional day when girls give candy to guys and then in exactly one month on March 14th is white day and is the day in which guys reciprocate and give candy back to girls um, it's complete bullshit and <laughs> like I can't tell you the pressure it puts on girls if it has to be that way um, my students don't do it that way anymore um, I'm sure still some people are secretly doing it that way, but what my students end up doing is everybody gives candy to everybody on Valentine's Day. All the girls give it to all their friends. Some of the girls give it to the guys. Some of the guys are clever and bring candy for all the girls too, and the girls love them for it. Um, <laughs> but um, for the most part, Valentine's Day is give treats and candy to all of your friends. And then White Day is largely ignored, um, except you do have some people who are reciprocating giving candy back. So the first year um, I did Valentine's Day here at my current office, um, I had learned over so many years of like what Valentine's Day was and how things happened. And I just went out and I bought enough candy to put all of the candy on everyone's desk in every place in the office. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. We have six different offices. Um, there's the gym office, the counseling office, the dean's office, the main office, um, the custodian's office, the um, staff room down at the main entrance. It's so many offices. And made sure I got enough candy that I could go around and give candy to everybody. Um, and that went over really, really amazingly well. And now I, of course, set myself up to that precedent. <laughs> so I have to do it every year. Um, but every year I cart bags and bags of candy all over campus. And I put candy on every single teacher's desk. And then, on March 14th on White Day... I get all the candy. <laughs> everybody, everybody in the school comes and finds me and I get giant stash, giant piles of candy. Um, I don't go out of my way to give like, I don't know, big boxes of candy. I usually get bags of Hershey Kisses or other candies um, and put like three or four Hershey Kisses or something. They will go and get me like these fancy boxes and I kind of wonder if it's just a thank you for remembering. Um, everybody gets busy. Everybody has a hard time. Um, but everybody deserves to have like a little treat here and there. So I kind of just wonder if they're just happy that I they got something. And that somebody, even if it's me, got them something um, on Valentine's Day. So it's it's just kind of a fun thing. Um, by everyone, I mean truly everyone. Not just uh, what you call um, like guys or girls. Everybody. Like every staff member, I wander around and find them. Um, sometimes I keep extra candy for the kids because you never know when a kid isn't going to you know, show up with something sweet for you. And then you have to be able to reach around and like hand something to them. So... Yeah, it's fun. Valentine's Day is just a nice day. And um, to heck with the only girls give and give it to the boys. Whatever. Um, younger generation, it's just uh, give candy to everybody. And then White Day is a chance to give back if you didn't have a chance to give them anything on Valentine's Day. White Day is the makeup day. Um, I don't give any candy out on White Day. Um, but I get a lot of thank you candies. Which is nice. Um, people are sweet. And so is chocolate. 
All right. And with that, happy Valentine's Day. I hope you have a great day um, and talk with you later. Man. <sighs> My brain is not completely awake in the morning. <laughs> I should probably make these videos. Welcome to morning after coffee in Kyoto, so I could at least think. <laughs>